Gary and I have been friends for a long time. I, I hope I'm not going to embarrass you. Can I tell a story about when we were? All right. Well, Gary was a... Gary's a young Which story man. is it? Oh, I'm not going to tell any of our good stories. We knew each other back when. Lucky to still be alive. We ain't any brighter, I guess. Got kids. Uh, but uh, I'll tell you what, man. Gary, when he was 16 years old, uh, I was playing in the club called Gravy Tees in Muscle Shoals. And I, I play there every Wednesday night. And I was in shift. We play Mondays and Wednesdays, different stuff. And all the time, different artists coming in there. And, uh, you know, you want to play. That's why I've always said those are auditions all the time. I was used to auditioning all the time. Well, Gary comes in one night, one of my, one of my buddies said, Man, you need to get this kid up here. Buy that man. I'm like, oh, man. So Gary gets up, and I'm, I'm serious. Uh, I joked him earlier. I, he's got his polo on and his kind of cat, and his short haircut. And he's this young kid. So, uh, and I'm this hippie in my holy jeans, my dashiki kind of shirt. All right. This guy gets up, and he rips apart a hunk of wood. Just, and then he starts singing, and he's just got this incredible soulful voice. Yeah. Six and I was so impressed. Long story short, we've been friends ever since. We used to do an acoustic act together. Yeah. Uh, I used to jam, and then I, Gary went out on tour with him. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Y'all know Gary. I love him. Y'all know his history. Y'all that didn't know him, you know him now. Um, but Gary and I ride together. And we wrote this little tune, uh, and we both cut it, and we both did the same kind of nuances, because we're the, we're the, we're the put it together. Y'all ready to have a little bit of fun? Jumping on into my space You might have seen a new head 